Welcome back to and this guides in today's video we are going to show you how to overlap the image of an object in Canva. Let's begin. Now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in Canva, I need you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Overlapping an image on an object in Canva is a powerful design technique with several benefits because it can add depth and complexity to your design, making it visually more engaging. For example, I have this specific thumbnail and I wanted two images to be overlapping with this uh, specific background. All right, so I have here this one and this one right here. For example, I'm going to, I want to extend it all the way here and this is going to be on the at the background now for us to be able to overlap that you might want to select the image first for example this one i want you to click on it and go to the uh, section that says there's going to be uh, three buttons here the ellipsis icon i want you to click on more and click on layer and go to send backward the thing is, it it went all the way to the back, but maybe maybe going for forward, going to front. All right. So this one, now this one is gonna be around the the, the front right now. I'm gonna put it in the bring the front. I'm gonna lower that so I would be able to have uh, three images at one point. Now we're going to create another page. We're going to make some videos here. So it's not an object, but basically a video. I'm gonna click with this one. And of course, I'm going to add this specific image here and put it right here. Okay, so this is basically overlapping with the images. Now, if I put this image, the white one, and I drag it here, see, I can't, I can't see it, right? Now, for me to be able to do that, just right click again, go to layer and go to uh, send to, or this one, the more options. Send to backward. The thing is, there you go. It's there. I'm going to put it to a little bit backward. And what I'm going to do is essentially maybe um, turn down the opacity, the transparency, like this one. Okay. I'm going to drag it all the way here. Basically, that's how you overlap elements here on Canva. All right. Now, the thing is, it can help create a focal point by contrasting the image with the object that draws attention to key areas. You see, it gives you a modern stylish appearance that can make your design more look contemporary and polished. It introduces a layered effect, which can make your design feel more sophisticated and multi-dimensional, right? But of course, it needs properly overlapping elements, which can achieve a balanced composition, by integrating different parts of the design in a cohesive way and again by doing so you can overlap and establish a clear visual hierarchy guiding viewers eyes to the most important elements of the design it's a straightforward process that could help you give important parts of the image or object making it easier for viewers to notice key elements once you're happy with that all you're going to do is click on share you can share it to social media or to any of your team collaborators if you're working with multiple freelancers thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next video